There's my newest vice president. How's your day so far? You can't hear the hissing in the office, Snake Pit, from here? I'm officially the boss's bimbo. And it didn't help matters when someone asked me to find the latest p and &E, and I thought it was a local convenience store down the street. Oh. And this bothered you? Oh, I can learn the lingo. No, no, I mean that they're referring to you as my... Your girlfriend. Right. I think I can handle it. Really? Yeah. Do you want to remind me why? Sure. Mm. Unfortunately for the rest of us, that would be a no. I am impressed with your proficiency. Do you watch a lot of porn? You know, it is customary to knock before entering a room. Well, believe me, I do apologize. However, this is your boardroom. It didn't occur to me that you would be making out with... What is that outfit? Secretary? Call girl? Help me here. Uh -huh. What can I do for you, Tracy? I'd like to talk with you alone. It's business. Well, if I remember, uh, <laughs> our business had fallen through. Things change. Okay, well, if you have a proposal for us, there's no reason why Sam can't hear it. <clears throat> We're listening. Okay, well, since little miss What's Your Pleasure lost the cards and the gambling rights to Luke, I went off in search of a new venture, and I happened to find one right under my nose. Uh, you see, putting AJ in charge of ELQ is probably the first sign of my father's encroaching dementia, because AJ has managed to drive the company right into the ground in a few short months. So it is ripe for a hostile takeover. I, of course, bring a very unique insider track to the table. However, I need some cash to fund the raid. So what's in it for me? 50% of the profits and me in charge to make sure that there are plenty. What do you think? May I say something, please? By all means. If Jax were to agree, and let me stress, this is purely hypothetical, he would be putting up all the cash and taking all the risks. The only split that makes any sense would be 75-25 in Jax's favor, and you do not get anywhere near the CEO's office. But out, hun. Why don't you go off in the corner and file your nails until Jax needs your services? Tracy, you're not going to get anywhere with me by insulting Sam. And I must say that you made a very astute assessment. I thank you, Jax. Any cash J and J Jax of Alaska might be willing to. Put up for a corporate rate on ELQ has to have a big enough return to justify the outlay. The right P and E. Yeah, then the price to earning ratio of acquiring ELQ. It doesn't seem like the right move right now. Oh, Jax, please. You are not really going to entertain the prattling of a common gold digger who would just as soon stab you in the back as look at you. Interesting question coming from you. In other words, he means it takes one to know one. You know, you really should be nice to Sam since she is my newest vice president. <laughs> Are you serious? Quite. Wow. That must be some bottom line you carry around. Don't get too comfortable in your new position. You're playing way out of your league. Jax, I'm offering you a brilliant opportunity. The kind you breathe for. My offer still stands. 50-50 split, me in charge. I want an answer now. My answer is that I will think about it. You know, Tracy's right. ELQ's begging for a takeover. I only said it didn't look good to annoy her. Yeah, I know you did. From what I'm able to put together here, the subsidiaries in London and Jakarta are in the worst shape. Hey, what's wrong with this window? What's wrong with it? I want it open. I don't know, I've never tried. 
Oh, why doesn't that surprise me, Jax? There's a big, beautiful sky out there and fresh air. Doesn't this just get old in here? You know, always just swearing about the ladies' peonies and Tracy's attempt to prove herself all the time. Hey, listen, if, uh, if you're warm, I can turn on the thermostat. No, 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 no. This isn't about the temperature, Jax. This is about my freedom, the way I used to feel on my boat. Sam, I know that you miss scavenging on the Lazarus, but you have so much more to offer. Believe me, what we do here is, is very exciting and quite profitable. Besides, you will have all the playtime in the world on the yacht of your choice. Just give it some time, okay? You'll see that this is the best of both worlds. Sky, what a surprise. You know, you should really call for an appointment first. Tell me, is that couture? Oh, wait, let me guess. Did a job offer come with that? Uh, Sam is my new VP. She's doing a really good job. Well, how nice for both of you. Well, I, I wouldn't dream of interrupting, so I will get right to the point. Um, Luke found enough money to fund the boat renovation. Faith Roscoe shows up and claims it's hers and demands it back. Of course, Luke refuses. What can I do to help? Well, obviously Faith means business. I mean, just ask what's left of the five families. I'd rather that Luke and my name not be added to that list because he's too pig-headed to know when to back down. So, I was wondering if, if, if possibly I could borrow the money from you to pay Faith back, and I am willing to sign an agreement that says I will pay you back at the going rate of interest from the profits of the finished casino. <clears throat> I'm sorry, is there something on your mind? I may be new at this, but I think I know what makes good business. And off the top of my head, looking at your request, I would say never in a million years. I have no idea why I ever asked Jax to give you a second chance. You know what? Just forget that I was even here. Sky. Why don't you admit why you're really sorry? Okay, ladies, just You know what? Stop. I'm disappointed and frustrated. Not that it's any of your business. I don't understand why you got my boat, you got my partnership with Luke, you got my casino. The only thing you did not get that I have is Jax. Any man who would be with you is not someone I would even be remotely interested in. Beauty. I just got her. Here, why don't, why don't you let me? Oh. A bowling? Uh, mooring hitch. Excellent. Best thing about a mooring hitch is how she holds under tension. There Thanks. you go. Thanks. My pleasure. The second best thing. 